Hello, hello, my dear friends, welcome to my channel, and today I'm filming the vlog about my cozy autumn day, and I decided to film this because I wanted to show you that even though the weather is getting cold and rainy, doesn't mean that you can have a great day and have fun and be in great mood. I start every single morning with brushing my hair, as you can see, this ritual kinda gives me joy every day, and then I'm creating this hair bar to start my skincare routine and skincare during the autumn and during the cold season is a little bit different from summer skincare routine so for cleansing my face I usually choose something more gentle and then I of course brush my teeth every morning after that I wipe my face with the paper towel I don't rub my face with the regular towel the next thing I do is massaging my body with a brush and this really helps me to get rid of puffiness in the morning then I'm heading to shower and after shower I continue with my skincare routine I use thermal water for my face and then I use uh, vitamin C this one is not the best one but I still need this and after vitamin C I'm using moisturizing cream and of course don't forget to massage your face and your neck and of course decollete zone because it's as important as the skin on your face and this little five minutes massage also helps to get rid of puffiness and to kind of lift your face and after moisturizing my face I moisturize zone under my eyes and actually around my eyes because this is really important skin under eyes is so thin and the last step of my skincare routine is of course SPF and even though it's a cold season it doesn't mean that sun is hiding somewhere so I really recommend you using SPF and after my skincare routine I usually read for a little bit especially when it's cold and rainy and you don't want to get out of your house I think it's super cozy and relaxing to read for a little bit in the morning currently I'm reading this book that was written by a surgeon and it's really, really interesting weather today in Dublin, California. Today in Dublin, it will be partly cloudy with a forecasted high of 23 and a low of 12. Right now it's 14 degrees and mostly cloudy. The next step in my morning routine is of course drinking a lot of water and after this I'm doing a little bit of makeup. Actually everything that I'm putting on my face is concealer and a little bit of lip balm to make my lips soft and shiny and to help them to stay soft during this cold weather. And the last step in my makeup is brushing my eyebrows. I also found these cute earrings and they really got me into this autumn mood, autumn vibes and for my look I decided to go with a sweater and jeans because it was a really cold morning that day then me and my husband we decided to warm up for a little bit usually on Sundays I don't work out but I do my warm-up anyway just to get my body moving and to warm up my muscles during this cold weather I think that this ritual always gets me really energized and ready to go and save the world. It might seem like not a good idea for you to go for a walk when it's really cold outside but I bet that you would not regret going out because fall is really beautiful the sky and the rain and all these fallen leaves are so beautiful that I'm pretty sure that even though you were in not a really good mood you will be there just try to find someone and go out or even go out alone and enjoy the weather my husband and I I have a little tradition to go somewhere on Sunday for breakfast and usually we choose some cute cozy Asian bakery or coffee shop uh, like Paris Baguette or maybe to Le Jour or something else and I think that this is a really great idea because usually these bakeries are super nice and cozy and they are always decorated for the season and right now as you can see they are decorated for for fall season and for Halloween. I 
Pilates. Thank you. So we are having breakfast in our favorite Paris baguette. We're having pumpkin spice lattice and some new pastries that were created specifically for this season, for the fall season. This is um, mochi sugar something. <laughs> Donut, I guess. Donut, yeah, and this is uh, maple pecan pastry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we are finishing our breakfast and now going to grocery store to buy some groceries and I'm gonna take you with me. Another good idea if you want to get into this fall vibes is to go to a grocery store and we went to Safeway but I think that any grocery store is gonna be suitable for this because they are always decorating the stores for autumn, for Halloween, for Thanksgiving, for New Year, Christmas and you can buy some little pumpkins or some other decorations or flowers or maybe vine or some kind of of uh, new spices or pumpkin spice coffee for your house and it will get you to this awesome mood I'm pretty sure So we came home, put the groceries in the fridge and now we're planning on cleaning the apartment, washing clothes, etc. So this is kind of Sunday reset <laughs> and I guess I'll see you later. These are flowers that we got, we put them in vase. I think it looks nice and the color is like <laughs> totally full mood. And another one is for a kitchen table and this is rose hips. I don't know what it means. <laughs> yeah, but I think it looks pretty as well. And I need to clean up this mess. Time pizza and chicken broth for Pasha and chicken broth with egg, chicken thigh and crudons for me. So what I really wanted to do next is to create a bucket list for fall. And I want to print this and hang on the fridge, for example. And I'm using uh, Canva.com for this. I actually use Canva for like everything, for creating to-do lists, for creating uh, thumbnails uh, on YouTube. And I think that I will find here something for my bucket list. Yeah, sure, they have pretty much a lot of different bucket lists with different designs and they even have autumn bucket lists this is what i need right now i don't really know what i'm gonna choose but i will definitely need to choose the free the free one because i don't have a pro account here so yeah free bucket lists are not so great as pro ones but i think that i will find something here well i actually really like this one yeah let's do it like this and here I could just delete, delete this one, and this one, and this one, and write down all the things that I wanted to do. Uh, so, cook 
something from pumpkin um drink pumpkin latte pumpkin spice latte autumn style photo shoot select colorful leaves i guess i i hope i wrote it correctly <laughs> maybe movie night and buy cozy sweaters i think that's it maybe i will change color here like this and while this is the end result i think that i will only need to print it out and i think that it looks really great oh also i would like to add something like this to kind of check the things that i already did and it's gonna have this light color and yeah this is the end result i think it looks really cute i also wanted to change the pictures that i have on my iphone screen because right now it's like pretty summery i think coconuts and uh, this californian scenery so i'm gonna use pinterest and i will just find something like autumn aesthetic oh my god look how cute is this there are so many pictures they are, they are all really cozy i don't even know what i'm what i'm gonna choose well that's it now i have this fall in new york picture on my home screen and this picture with pumpkins on my lock screen well now i'm gonna go read for a little bit and then i'm going to cook borscht this is a russian beef and beet soup and maybe i'll share the recipe with you as well One of my favorite rituals for cold days is taking a bath and I usually add there some salt and oils and foam so it gets even cozier. And before going to sleep I highly recommend you to do some stretching or maybe yoga or even meditation. It will help you sleep better and it will give you this relaxation that you really need before going to sleep. And a good sleep is really important to your body and it will help you to wake up in a good mood on the next day. Good morning! hello hello it's the next day it's 8 a.m in the morning and i feel so great after yesterday's kind of reset i feel really inspired and i have a lot of energy so i hope you liked my video if so please give it a thumb up and see you in the next one